Annie, thank you. It is 532 and if you've driven along I-395 lately, maybe you've noticed the construction for months. Crews have been working at the old landmark mall site right on Duke Street and this morning some of their plans for that site are really starting to come into focus. Marcella Robertson joins us now with the latest and Marcella, it's a big deal for Alexandria. Was this one of your malls back in the day? It was. Okay. It was definitely and you know we all kind of saw a landmark and the, the downfall of that so uh, we have had a pretty good idea of what planned for the former landmark site, a new hospital, more housing. Uh, take a look at these new renderings, though. This is what developers want West End Alexandria to be a vibrant space. We're talking dining, retail, an ice skating rink, and even pickleball courts. In May of last year, this wrecking ball went through the old landmark mall. An exciting revival. Today, construction to get this site ready is well underway, making room for the brand new Innova at Landmark Hospital. But that's just one part of this. Dirt's moving, infrastructure's going in. Developer Folger Pratt already has the overall approval for this massive project. But this week, special use permits approved by the Planning Commission show this vision starting to take shape. These renderings show plans for two retail and restaurant pavilions, an open rooftop area, trails, an ice skating rink, and pickleball courts. Mindy Lyle is a longtime member of the Alexandria Planning Commission. It will change the way people look at this part of the city. A fire station, affordable housing and transit hub are also part of the long term plans for West End. The Planning Commission also approved the signage package for this project, an important step to attract retailers so they know how they'll be able to advertise. Another step forward in the project, some leaders say, will bring the West End back to life. And the developer will go before city council with these plans at the end of the month. This $2 billion project is going to open in phases with the first building set to open in 2025. Uh, still going to be a while before we see that new Innova hospital, though. The goal for that is a 2028 grand opening. Guys.